Hey guys, so today I'm here with an overview of the recent Google Chrome event. Uh, so then talked about a lot of things. Let me go ahead and tell you a little bit about what all they unveiled. Uh, so the, one of the bigger things was the Chrome Web Store. Uh, now the Chrome Web Store will be live later today and I will have a video. So look on the screen for an annotation as soon as I get a video a hands-on showing exactly what it is. Um, but the Chrome Web Store does look very cool. You can go ahead and purchase apps as well as just go ahead and just download them for free. Um, and there are a lot of really interesting ones, so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing more on that. However, the major focus of the event was certainly Google Chrome OS. And now, we've been hearing about this for quite a while. However, this we've got a lot more details on it, uh, release dates, all that kind of good stuff. Um, so it's not done yet. So if you were looking for a Chrome OS uh, release date t uh, you know, today or soon, uh, no, it's actually going to be the first notebooks are going to be launching sometime in the middle of next year. However, we do know a lot more information, and they actually are going to do a pilot program. Um, so basically what this pilot program is all about is that they have, it's called the CR48, the first, very first Chrome OS laptop. Uh, now basically they are going to be distributing this through the pilot program, which I'll have a link to in the description if you're interested in trying to apply. Um, basically it's going to be like a public beta where some people will actually go ahead and get one of these Chrome OS laptops and you test it and you know talk about it and all that kind of stuff which is definitely going to be very very cool. And I won't really get into the laptop as it's not going to be the actual uh, thing that you'll be able to buy. Of course this is just for the early adopters. Um, however let me go ahead and talk just a bit more about Chrome OS. Um, so everything we've heard about Chrome OS before, all that remains, you know it's going to be an instant on, well not instant on, but very very close. Uh, it's going to go ahead and boot very, very fast. They talked a lot about the security features, the sandboxing, all that kind of stuff. Um, however, there's some really cool things I want to go ahead and discuss. Uh, one thing that we didn't know before was that every Chrome OS netbook is going to have built in 3G. And this is going to be great. And in addition, if you're in the United States, um, all of them will actually come with two years worth of free 3G from Verizon Wireless. Uh, so basically what, the way it will work is that it's kind of similar to on the iPad, except a better deal in my opinion, where you can go ahead and you get 100 megabytes of free data every single month for the next two years. So if I bought one today, I would have two years of 100 megs every month. In addition to that, you, with no contracts, you can go ahead and buy pay-as-you-go, so you can get a day pass for un with unlimited or you can go ahead and get perhaps a gigabyte or however you want to do it. Um, it's all activated on the Chrome OS notebook itself. So very, very cool stuff right there. Anyway, guys, that's it for my overview of all what they talked about. Now, of course, there's a lot more, but most of the stuff is kind of just repeated. We've already seen a lot of it. Um, you know, a couple of the key things I really liked was the fact that how fast and simple it is to set up and use. Um, so actually, they actually showed uh, they took a brand new Chrome OS notebook they, turn, they turned it on for the first time, and literally all you need to do is accept the terms. You need to go ahead and take, you know, set up a profile picture, plug in your Google account details, and it was already set up. So it was really, really fantastic. You know, anyone can attest to if you buy, you know, a brand new Windows or Mac. You know, you turn it on, you set it up, all this kind of stuff. But with the Google Chrome OS, it took less than a minute to have it fully set up with all your bookmarks and all that kind of stuff, which are of course imported from your Google account. Uh, so there's some really cool things. I'm excited to go ahead and get my hands on a Chrome OS notebook and give you guys more information. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching.